Hello everyone, how are you all? Today I will take objects of database for class 8. Now let us begin with the topic objects of database. We have four objects of our database. The first one is table, second is query, third is form and the last one is the report. All objects of a database are stored in a single file and are managed through the database window. The first one is table. It contains actually the actual data that is in a table. In MS Access, the related entries are stored in row and they are known as records and columns are known as fields. See this table. I have explained it in the table format. You can see it there is written as student name, parents name, roll number, class and the address. Now these are all known as the fields and also these are columns. So fields are known as columns. Now suppose I am writing Parul, the student's name, parents name, roll number. So this becomes the record. You can see we have record for Parul, Sandeep and Kajal. So, records are known as rows and fields are known as columns. So, this is all known as the table. Now, we have query. It is used to get a record or a group of records that fulfill a particular condition. For example, I want to find the address of roll number 7 class A. A. So, this is going to be a query. Second is the form. It is like a fill in the blank sheet where we fill in the particulars by hand. You may have a declaration form. Last one is the report. It is the printout. We print the report like we print the report card and the patient report card. These are the examples of the reports. That's all for today. That's, a, that's all for today. Have a nice day. Thank you.